Hello and welcome to another video. My name is Boxiest, and today we're going to continue the What If series. What if events had gone differently? And in this What If, we're going to change the history of Cobra Kai. What if Jack Brewer was in Cobra Kai? Part 3. If you haven't seen the previous two parts, I would recommend you go watch them before continuing this one. So in this what if, the characters from Kicking It will be canon to the Miyaiverse, and they will exist in the same universe. So in this timeline, Jack would continue his training with Chris, and Johnny would run Eagle Fang, those events would carry on, Daniel would run Miyaido, and he would have Sam as his first student. In this timeline, Robbie would go to the same school as Sam, so they would meet a lot sooner in this timeline, and Sam and Robbie would start to become friends. So Daniel and Johnny would meet once again, and Danny would realize that they couldn't beat Chris on their own. So Danny would suggest that they team up, and at first, Johnny would be against it, but Johnny would realize that he needed Daniel to take down Chris. So Daniel and Johnny would team up a lot sooner in this timeline, and the events of Cobra Kai would continue. Chris would find out that Daniel and Johnny had teamed up, so much like in the original timeline, Chris would still get Terry Silver. So Terry Silver would still come back and become another sensei at Cobra Kai. Those events would carry on. Terry Silver would start training the students. And much like Chris, Terry would take an interest in Jack. So Jack and Terry would start training together. Terry would teach Jack the Quicksilver method. And much like Robbie in the original timeline, Terry would get Jack to fight him, so Jack and Terry would fight, but unlike Robbie, Jack would manage to land a hit on Terry, and Terry Silver would be impressed. So Terry Silver would tell him that he has more potential than any student that he's ever seen, so Terry and Jack would continue their training, and the events of Cobra Kai would continue. Daniel and Johnny would teach their students a combination of offense and defense, and they would start training for the All Valley. Jack would continue his training with Chris and Terry, and he would continue to fully embrace the No Mercy philosophy, and the night of the All Valley, Cobra Kai and Miyai Feng would compete, Jack would start easily winning his matches, and he would show No Mercy, Sam and Robbie would also be competing, and they would use a combination of offense and defense, Jack and Robbie would make it to the semi-finals, the fight would begin, Robbie would give it all he's got, while Jack would be holding back, he would remember training with Robbie, and he would decide to go easy on him, so Robbie would land a point against Jack, Chris would get mad, and he would want to talk to Jack. So he would ask him the same thing that he asked Robbie in the original timeline. If he was fighting his friend, or if he was fighting his opponent, he would say that he thought he was a champion. So the fight would continue. Jack and Robbie would continue to fight, but this time Jack wouldn't hold back. He would show no mercy, and he would easily defeat Robbie. So Jack would advance to the finals. He would still be showing no mercy, and much like the last All Valley, Jack would still win, and he would be the two-time All-Valley champion. Cobra Kai would continue to expand and grow, and Terry Silver would put more funding into Cobra Kai. Chris and Terry would continue to run Cobra Kai, and much like in the original timeline, Terry would want to hire more senseis, and many senseis across the state would come to the Cobra Kai Dojo to audition, including Sensei Rudy Gillespie. And that is where I'm going to end part 3. Thank you guys for watching. What do you guys think would have happened if Jack Brewer joined Cobra Kai? Let me know in the comments below. YouTube lets me know that the majority of you are not subscribed, so if you guys could subscribe, that would be much appreciated. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you guys next time.